Vice President Kamala Harris has decided on Minnesota Governor Tim Walz as her running mate in her bid for the White House. Here's five things to know about the Minnesota governor and what he brings to the ticket. One, Walz comes from rural America and was born in West Point, Nebraska, a community of about 3,500 people northwest of Omaha. He and his wife moved to Mankato in southern Minnesota in the 1990s. Two, Walls is an Army National Guard veteran, having served 24 years before retiring from a field artillery battalion in 2005 as a command sergeant major, one of the military's highest enlisted ranks. Three, he was a social studies teacher at Mankato West High School, where he also coached football, including the 1999 team that won the first of the school's four state championships. Walls was also a longtime member of the teachers' union. Four, Walls served six terms in the U.S. House of Representatives, having upset a Republican incumbent in his first race in 2006. In the House, Walls championed veterans' issues. Five, Walls is a two-term governor with experience with divided government. In his first term as governor, Walls faced opposition by Republicans for his handling of the COVID-19 pandemic and the sometimes violent unrest that followed the murder of George Floyd by a Minneapolis police officer in 2020. But things got easier for Walls in his second term, after Democrats gained control of both legislative chambers, clearing the way for a more liberal course in state government, aided by a huge budget surplus. During that second term, Walls and lawmakers eliminated nearly all of the state abortion restrictions enacted in the past by Republicans, protected gender-affirming care for transgender youth, legalized recreational use of marijuana, and funded free school meals for children.